Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is my Road to 10k update. I think this is number six. Wow. Okay, so if you're new, hey, my name is Courtney and I'm updating you every single week that I get paid. I'm on the road to save $10,000. Also, I am paying off one credit card and you guys are on the journey with me. So if you would like to see anything about that, then just keep on watching. Okay guys, so I just got paid yesterday. Today is the 19th and let me up let me look at the price because we're going to start with my credit card. Oh! It just went through. Okay. So, last episode, I was at $1,400 because originally I was at 1,390, but the interest went and it bumped me up to $1,411. So I am on the road to pay off this credit card in four payments, which is really exciting. It is kind of hard to budget, but you got, I gotta do it because if I don't do it quickly, then I'm never gonna pay it off. And that's just how it goes for me. I don't know how you guys do it, but like, this is how it, this is how it's working for me. I just need it to happen really quick, if that makes sense. So yesterday when I got paid, I paid, instead of paying $495, I decided to pay $511.39. That way it can go down to a more even number. So my credit card is at $900 now, and that's so exciting. And this is my second payday in May, but I also have an extra one <clears throat> i think most people have a third payday in may so i was looking at it as oh i got a free extra payday no after doing a little research i realized that extra extra payday is going to push back my first payment in june so i really need to be strategic about this i cannot throw all this money away on my third payment towards this credit card because I will not have anything to pay my bills in the first two weeks of June. So I really got to figure out what I have to spend and what I can pay on the credit card, which is really hard because most of my big bills are in the first two weeks of the month. So that's a lot of money. Basically, I have my car payment, which is a lot, but we're not going to get into that because I got into it like last episode, I think. So my car payment needs to be paid. Phone bill needs to be paid. Hulu. And then I have a credit card payment. So, so now that I have $900 that I owe, I need to calculate my bills for the first week. So basically my third extra payment in May, I need to save $726 so that I have enough to cover my bills for the first two weeks of June. And that is literally so much money. <laughs> Um, so if I calculated it right, I should have about $474 left and that is not including gas and groceries, but also I have a graduation to go to in between that. So I also need to be able to make sure I calculate extra money for a gift card and a birth, a graduation card and extra money to give. So basically this whole, pe this third paycheck is going out the window as soon as it comes in, which sucks. And I'm trying not to spend a credit card. I just got to push really hard to budget and not spend extra money anywhere, which is going to be really hard for me because I always need some money to spend on myself. But it looks like I'm not going to be able to do that. So this um, next two weeks and the beginning of June is going to be a real challenge for me. So yeah, mm, I'm not really excited as I thought it would be. <laughs> Last video, I was so excited for the extra payment, but this video... When I actually wrote things down and thought about it, it's not much. So I am really happy that I have my credit card down to $900. I just really, I don't think I'm going to reach my challenge of paying the card off my first paycheck of June. So it might be my second paycheck of June that's going to be paid off. But that's still okay because my credit card will be paid off in June and it's going to be put up. When you saw in the last video, I did have a $100 payment. It was really good. So I also need to make another $100 payment into my cash stuffing. So we're going to do that now.
So guys, that's going to be it for this video. I really thought I would have more exciting news, but I don't. The only exciting thing is that I have my credit card down to 900 and that's really great. Um, I do see this being paid off in June, which is very exciting, and I just can't wait to have it paid off, to be honest. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you in my next video. Bye! Oh, 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 oh